right, my name is Tyler, aka Nanogenics, and today we're back for a brand new Dokkan reaction to a kid Gohan. I have absolutely no idea what to expect here. Um, it does look like it is from the essentially Garlic Jr. saga. Um, not necessarily Dead Zone, I don't think, but probably the actual anime. We'll see. We'll see as we watch. It's been a minute since I've seen either of those. Uh, obviously, I'm a little late to this because I was watching the Friends reunion, which, by the way, if you care at all about Friends, freaking dope it was so freaking good so we're here brand new agl uh, gohan looks like he does have a partner super attack which is super dope but i think the reason we're all here i have videos dating back all the way to five years ago when i started first making videos saying when are we going to get a garlic jr and he is finally and officially in the game i mean literally zero representation for this dude right here and the entirety of dokkan which is one of the only games to exist in dragon ball history to have like this many like just different characters available to use you know what i mean it's just absolutely absurd so garlic jr is finally here the only real person we're missing now you get in the nitty-gritty right like farm with a shotgun you know random things like that but it's like dr willow that's about it so uh, they finally brought him it looks like he's a side banner character if you haven't been paying attention to all this stuff the actual dokkan fest is gohan and then the side banner unit is garlic jr and then one final thing we have a brand new lr from new sbr stages so this lr trunks right here is actually free to play and i'm not gonna hold y'all that art is sick um honestly all these sbr units have been really really dope lately so uh this is just right there in that same league with them so we actually have super attacks for this lr and i'm sure they've also combined the garlic jr super attacks and all that so that's what we're here for here we go let's uh let's peep these let's check these out new lr right here yo what Yo, Dude, the fact that he's got the car is just the sickest thing to me, man. <laughs> Yo, he just pulls up on him. Key blast. All right, I'm out. Let's watch it one more time. Let's watch it one more time. I love it. I love that he hops out of the car, goes and beats, <laughs> then just hops right back in. Oh my God. It's so good. It's so good nothing like crazy like the actual animations actually the hair and stuff it's kind of dope looking but uh never mind never mind it's actually really sick <laughs> there's a lot going on here with the, the hair animation i think the thing that's is just killing me is the fact that he, he hops out beats up cell hops back in the car all right let's go shopping like i i love it it's just like he's on his way he's on his way to pick up you know a new jacket whatever and he's like, all right, here we go. Uh, oh, look, hang on, the cell, hang on. Y'all stay in the car. Bop, all right, let's go, get, let's go, let's go. It's great, okay. Um, all right, as we dive into this, I gotta, I gotta do it. Hit that like button if you guys enjoying the video. Subscribe if you guys are new. Um, and Nano too, we, we're actually really legitimately putting out videos over there. Nanotech, links to both in the description. Go subscribe, go be ready for videos over there. Uh, new reaction on Nano 2 just popped out today. I have a link to it below. And uh, yeah, so anyways. Ooh, new OST. Garlic Jr. finally in the game. Yo! I mean, there's not a lot you can do with Garlic Jr., so, like, they, they did it. They did it. Okay, this is pretty basic looking. Never mind. I lied. I, I spoke way too soon. Let's go! <laughs> hey, yo! Woo! Oh, dude. Let's get it! Let's go, dude. What? Better yet, why have you not hit the like button? Real talk. Why have you not subscribed? Oh my gosh. That was actually so good. Hang on one more time. Yeah, Garlic Genius is kind of like... 
I mean, he's Garlic Jr. At least he's in the game. You know what I mean? That is dope looking, but. And this, I'm like, ah, oh, okay, it's basic. He's like punching. Oh, okay, it's basic. And then Doga's like, nah, 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 nah. That <laughs> looks so dope. Oh, man. Okay. And then freaking Budokai 3 style, like destroying of Earth. We got an active and a partner, a partner skill too. Are you kidding me? This OST, this OST goes hard. Yes. 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 All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I got to see if I can find some translations or something. Holy crap, that is dope. Shout out to, of course, RDBZ Dokkan Battle over here. We got we got the details. Uh, AGO Gohan, of course, kid. Heavenly Events Category Lead, Key Plus 3, Stats Plus 170. Bond of Master and Disciple Category, Key Plus 3, Stats Plus 150. His 12 key raises defense and causes miss damage to the enemy with a medium chance to stun. He, of course, then has his unit super attack, which can be activated when there is an ally named Piccolo or Krillin. Looks like you can't have the youth Krillin, you can't have Majin Buu, you can't have Demon King Piccolo, all of that. Just straight up Piccolo or Krillin. Uh, full power Masinko. Greatly raised attack for one turn, raises defense, and causes immense damage to the enemy with a high chance to stun the enemy. Passive is uh, Decision of Pride, defense plus 158, attack plus 158 when launching a super attack. Uh, plus an additional attack and defense plus 58 when there's another heavenly events category allies on the same turn plus an additional attack plus 58 after receiving an attack all allies keep plus three and defense plus 58 percent plus an uh, own additional attack plus 58 and stuns the attack enemy within the same term of performing a super attack after what in the freaking crap bro yeah the, they're getting to a point where these dfes are literally putting up i mean we're we are to the point where dfes are putting up much higher attack stats and numbers than lr since it's actually insane um than LRs that we previously were like, what? You know, like it's it's actually crazy. Active skill can be activated when HP is 58% or less once only. That's not bad at all. Active restore 30% HP, guards all attacks for one turn and all allies plus 20% uh, defense for two turns. That's actually super dope. You can pause that on the links and categories if you want to check that out. Um, and then Garlic Jr. Heavenly events category, key plus three, HP, DAC, and defense plus 120. Super attack greater is his attack and causes supreme damage to the enemy. Passive is attack and defense plus 160 at the start of turn. When attacking a super class enemy, gain an additional attack and defense plus 60% with a medium chance to stun the enemy. Extreme class allies key plus three, attack and defense plus 40%. Recovers 10% HP at the end. He's dope, dude. I kind of hoped he'd have some some sort of some form of like immortality. You can also take a, a pause that if you want, but uh, that's fine as well. And then the free to play LR STR Trunks, who uh, again, I think, it, yeah, I, I thought he just had Trunks in the name, so he's just a teen Trunks unit. Vegeta Family Lead, key plus three, stats plus 120. 12 key raised attack and defense for one turn. 18 key raised attack and defense for one turn. Attack and defense plus 80%. Key plus one, a chance to dodge plus 15% per Vegeta's Family category ally on the set. That's dope. Key plus three and defense plus 60 as the first attacker in a turn. Attack and defense plus 30% and Vegeta's Family category allies key plus three as the second attacker in a turn. And key plus three and attack plus 60% as the third. I was like, I kind of like units when they do that. It really makes you kind of sort of think better, more like about your placements, your rotations, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, based on everything I'm seeing here, I'm kind of sad that Garlic Jr. doesn't have some form of like an immortality built in, but the fact that he's a side can character without like an active or something to, for them to sort of give that to, that doesn't surprise me. Uh, Garlic Jr. could be a cool character though, in my personal opinion as a card. This card is going to be really defined by heavenly events. And if that category is good, there may already be a data download. I'm not going to look into it right now. That's the video though. Holy crap. He actually looks dope. I was kind of like, man, Kip Gohan, I don't know, but he, he does look cool. He looks really cool. And he sounds super busted as you would expect from a Kid Gohan because a Kid Gohan to the masses is just not, I don't know. There's just not going to be that many people summoning for a Kid Gohan. I don't feel like, but we'll see. Anyways, if you enjoyed it, enjoyed it, hit the like button if you're new, subscribe. Be sure to check out the other channels. I appreciate you guys that have. For real, for real, for real, it means a lot to me. But y'all have a great day. Have Y'all have a great night. All those things. Keep on keeping on. Now, Genix and off, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.